Here is a video instruction on how to install your soft close mechanism onto your barn door hardware. Before proceeding with the installation by referring to the manual on page one, checking all the parts that come in the soft close kit. If you happen to encounter any issues such as missing or defective parts, please don't hesitate to contact customer support immediately for proper placements. The contact info is behind the instruction manual. The tools you will need are a Phillip cross head screwdriver, a 1 8 drill bit, and a pen or pencil. Now let's proceed with the installation. Before you mount the clamp on the soft close, find out the closing side of the soft close. The closing side is the side with the two indented stripes. This is how you indicate where the soft close will be pointing that is where the door will be closing. Usually at the end of the track on the left, you will have the soft close indented strike facing you on the left, and at the right end of the track, you will have the right side of the soft close with the indented stripes. For double door that meets in the middle, there will be two soft closes that mount in the middle of the track. The left door will have the indented stripes on the soft close pointing to the right, and for the right door, the indented stripes will be pointing to the left. Install the clamp onto the soft close with the machine tapping screw with the screw going through the soft close and tightening on to the clamp thread holes. Making sure you install this on the correct side of the soft close on where you will be installing this on to the track. Clamps will be installed facing you. Repeat this on both ends of each soft close. Now slide the door to the close position to where the soft close is at and place the actuator between the tongue of the soft close on top of your door. Make sure that your soft close tongue is at the close position. This will be where you mount the actuator. Now use a pencil and mark the positions as you see here within the preferred mounting area. Take the door off the track with a 1 8 drill bit drill the hole on top of the door about one half deep. This will provide easier installation of the screws and prevent wood from splitting. You can now screw the three screws provided per actuator like this. Repeat this step on the other side of the door or on your second door. Now place the doors on the track to try out the soft close mechanism. If your actuator is not high enough to be in between the tongue, the height of the actuator must be adjusted. You can now stack the actuator with the actuator spacer provided in the box. Now put that back in place and check if the actuator is in the correct height where it is tall enough to hit both sides of the tongue. After adding the actuator spacer and you find out that it is still not tall enough, you can now raise the actuator piece with the thinner Allen key. Place the Allen key into the slot on top of the actuator and turn clockwise. You will see the actuator rising. Now place the raised actuator with the actuator spacer on top of the door same placement as where the tongue of the soft close meets. Once the height is correct, you can now mount it with the screws provided on the top of the door. Your installation of the soft close mechanism is now complete.